hey what's up everybody out there in youtube land it is your girl ashley welcome to my channel grown folk and i want you guys to know something guess what come close come close it's my birthday it's my birthday <laughs> okay i'm very happy about that all right so i just wanted to share that so i would love to see a whole bunch of happy birthdays down below that would just make my birthday okay but y'all know I already came here to tell y'all some, some it just shit just, just getting on my nerves that I feel I want to share with my peoples, okay? Okay, because y'all get in people's ass and that's how it should always be. You should never let something so stupid go by without letting them know that shit was stupid, all right? Therefore, they might stop being stupid. You get what I'm saying? So, you know what I already want you to do. I want you to get down below and comment on what I'm about to talk about. I definitely want you to subscribe if you are not a subscriber. I thank you if you are a subscriber. And hit that notification button. And damn sure give me a like if you enjoy this video. If you don't like it, you don't have to do that. But if you do like it, take the time out to hit that little thumbs up. Because I would appreciate that, okay? Now, okay, what we're going to talk about is Hazel E trifling trap ass okay now i know i just made a video on her silly behind three weeks ago okay that was like my last video i believe i i don't know three weeks ago was my last video but i know i made a video of her dumb ass and recording her toddler getting his ass whooped you know we should have called child abuse services on her ass for that right there but see we let her slide and she out here in these streets acting a fool again okay because she has took her ass to social media you know where she get thugged up most of the time because lord no it is never the streets so she goes to social media and to make a long story short um you know she damning all dark-skinned women to hell pretty much because we all just jealous of her because of her skin tone and she mentions the brown paper bag you know and then she thanks her mother at the end because she says mommy you tried to warn me about these dark tone monkey heifers I ain't listening I guess she was trying to befriend all dark skinned folks I don't know hey so girl I hope somebody just whoop your ass on sight in the store that best makes no sense ma no sense at all okay because i'm gonna refer back to you what that young man referred to you plastic bottle arrow shaped hat nigga okay because bitch is questionable at this point it's like why are you so angry are you mad because you know your man taking pipe because we all know that his little boyfriend that came out and said it and then you want to sit there okay y'all she sits there and after um the the toddler rose sits there and and burned the, the little gay flag you know they pissed off the gay people which was also his boyfriend so they got to arguing up in their dms and whatnot and after he got bossed up and the boyfriend was like oh you wants to try me let me post this shit so somehow hazel e connected jess hilarious the comedian and said she paid somebody she don't even know the look, she don't even know the boy, but she paid him to put fake messages out there with all the Rose Burgundy correct information. Bitch, ain't nobody got time for that. That boy is gay. You know he is gay. His boyfriend said he is gay. He looks gay. He's gay, okay? And you running out here mad because everybody is telling you he gay. Like, Hazel, honey, you cannot come at no dark skin toned woman because trying to say we are insecure, honey, and you can't find a man that really like you, okay? Don't get mad at us because you can't do that because that that's what it seems like to me, okay? So just set your ass down, okay, Hazel? Because you is just embarrassing, all right? You are, ooh, child, you embarrassing. Set your ass down. Your mama tried to tell you in that damn show. You didn't listen to her? Listen to the world. Listen to his boyfriend, all right? That man had too much information on Denzel Young, okay, to not be knowing that man. So you can cut that shit out that toddler likes the dick okay next subject masika and that trifling ass alexis i can't stand both them bitches with mm. okay 
as we all know, Alexis is finally pregnant by Fetty Wap. And I strongly suggest the next woman that sleeps with Fetty Wap to make sure you got protection on you. Okay, make sure you got something for you, him, and hell, all his friends just just to just pass it around the room. Cause it seems like anything the man touch, he gonna knock up. Like this is redam ridiculous. But we see Alexis, dumb ass, is pregnant. Now I know people. Hey, why she dumb? Why she dumb? Look at her. Listen to her. Okay, cause Alexis, she cute. She ain't all that, but she cute. But Alexis is dumb as hell. Okay. She talked dumb. She can't do no clapbacks. And when I saw Lee Hayes make that video of her say, so y'all double teaming me, and she was like, yep, yep. Bitch, I was like, oh, my gosh. Just be like, <sighs> okay. Anyway, so she's pregnant. So we all know Love & Hip Hop Hollywood have, has ended, thank God. And they had the first little reunion right after the last episode. I uh, don't know what that was about. But we saw on there, you know, they had her in the back. You know, because she's talking about saying, we're pregnant with child. But you're pregnant with child when you're with that man. Otherwise, you're pregnant. Bitch. You're not pregnant with child with you and Fetty. Because Fetty got a girlfriend named Blue. Okay, which was probably sitting on the couch laughing at you and Masika's ass. Because that's what me and my man would have been doing at two dumb bitches like you. Okay, because that just don't make no sense. Now, you sitting up here just so proud and pregnant, you know, of a man that's not about to treat you no better than he was treating you before, okay? And Masika, since Masika, since Alexis has come out and said she's pregnant, Masika has now came into revelations. Y'all, I'm outside, so the damn loud ass truck. Anyway, Masika has come out to revelations that um, Fanny Wap has wanted her to birth him two more children. So every time Alexa say, she, you know, I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant, you know, getting under Masika's skin, she says, yeah, you, yeah, you know, give him, yeah, I'm thankful you're giving him the two babies he keeps begging me for, bitch. He didn't claim the first one, okay? Went on TV and did not claim the first one. Masika, don't sit up here and lie to us like we is some plum fools. I can't take shit like that now. You, he sat there and denied the child all the way to the very end. Okay, so you were forced doing all type of interviews on TMZ. Talking about some, oh yeah, we're pregnant. Just like Alexis was doing that dumb shit the other night. Yeah, you were doing that shit too. And so he made a public announcement saying he didn't think that baby was his. Then your ass got zipped up real quick. And then what happened? You went into talking about some, <laughs> he's just a this and just a that. And we had to hear you whine all through your damn pregnancy. When you knew the nigga wasn't going to do nothing from the jump. Okay? So, I need you to cut that out all the way. Just don't do it again. Because both of y'all look very, very foolish. Okay. Hey. Both of y'all look very foolish. All right. And I just need y'all to stop. Because I just, it embarrasses me when other women embarrass themselves. Okay. You know. So, let's take that to a medium. Let's stop doing it. Let's. And, but I do want to say this, and I'm going to leave Masika alone. Masika, when you got up and talking about some, where that bitch at, where that bitch at, girl, I wanted to come through that TV because you sit there and ran from this hole all season long. But then you want to go marching through the halls of the reunion to find somebody you know you can't hit because she pregnant. Girl, if you don't set your ass out, I will pop you my damn self. See, I don't like fronting bitches like you. I, you got, you, because you pulled Hazel hair and pulled her over the thing because that's a scary bitch. You think you didn't got your Wheaties and everything. Somebody needs to pop your ass, okay, because you ain't got it all your damn self. And I just, I, I just, I want y'all just to set all the way down. I'm so glad y'all season is over. I'm so glad because I don't want to hear nothing else from y'all, okay? And for you to sit there, Masika, and say that with the anything, with the baby. See, let me tell you how you a bum bitch for saying that, okay? Because like Alexa said, since you hoes like to fuck without condoms, them babies are going to be siblings. So at some point, you two hoes need to boss up like you try to say you are 
be women and make sure those children have a relationship, okay? Since you want to fuck niggas without condoms, okay? Back to back, since that's what y'all want to do, like Drake say, back to back, that's what y'all did, right? So, when you sitting up there talking about some Annie, yeah, baby, you're gonna be, the baby's gonna be Annie, Annie, and all this, you're disrespecting the man you sitting up there trying to get back by steady having babies by him, which is fed it, okay, dumbass? You're disrespecting him if you disrespect a child. See, this is why these men don't stay with y'all dumb asses because you don't know this. How you don't know this? Because you're too busy jumping from bed to bed because you went from bird to, to um, fatty real damn quick and you said you was in love with both of them. Now, come the hell on. Now, I, mm -mm. too much plan for me, Masika, okay? Too much plan for me. All right, so that's my opinion on Masika and Hazel, and um, I just, you know, I want them to have a seat all the way down. I, I want y'all to go look at um, that video with Rose's boyfriend, because he told it all, oh, baby. He was laid up in the bed, just put Rose Burgundy, uh, Rose Burgundy's boyfriend in the damn engine, and the video gonna pop up, okay? I might just make another video, and we might watch it together, you know, how we do our little videos when we watch them together and stuff. We might do that, okay? Do something for my birthday or something with y'all or something. Because I was all into the shit. Like, what? I mean, because he was telling everything. Not everything. Everything, okay? That's a whole nother level of information. Everything, okay? When, when that ain't even a word, that's a whole nother level of information. And let me tell you, he was pissed, okay? I guess you better not be burning no damn um, flag for um, the LGBTQ community sorry i don't know all about it but um you know and then you you kind of dabbing in it that ticks them off as it should and yeah and rose <laughs> you you just got caught you know but we knew you was gay nigga when that dude when sincere said you you ain't even a nigga you ain't even got a hood name nigga you ain't even a nigga to be a nigga he was so correct because you stood in front of a jet acting like it was yours and you don't have a car okay and hazel running around acting like you ain't gay when her mama damn near told her on tv so i want the foolery to stop okay that's what i need y'all to do for me the love and hip-hop crew of hollywood okay i just need y'all to set all the way down and i see that masika and riley nia riley got into some shit, but I don't even care. I don't even care. I'm just let y'all know that happened if y'all want to go look that up. Because I care not to talk about that shit. That is just boring. You know? Just boring. I don't even remember what the hell a reply was. I don't even remember what the argument was. So you know the shit is boring. But they had a little whatever, whatever, whatever. And it, it, wasn't, it wasn't worth nothing. I wouldn't even go look that up. But I just thought I'd tell y'all anyway. But anyway, so that's what, you know, I'm going to talk about right here on this video. And then I'm going to make another video. And I'm going to talk about, you know, Nelly and uh, Nene and uh, Wendy. Okay, we got to get that on out there too because she got her ass roasted. And I will be commenting on that, okay? But I want to know how you guys feel about, first of all, Masika saying that anything because like i said that pissed me off because being a woman like you you sitting up there trying to go so hard for your baby when you sit there and you told hey it's like when she told hazel uh you know you you can't even have a baby and all that it's like you might want to humble yourself because you do not god will humble your ass quickly and hazel may have lost her child but don't think god won't snatch your child don't think he won't do it so you might want to just stop saying shit like that all together because you look up and that'll be the situation okay but i want to know how y'all feel on that what y'all think on that we all know rose is gay so we ain't got to talk about that no more but y'all can go ahead and comment again on it if y'all want to you know but i just want to know how y'all feel about everything i just said because i just told y'all what i felt so yeah i usually agree with me except for them little bum bitches that come want to whine oh her eyelash oh her this oh honey did she have a stroke you, you bitches go fly somewhere off a cliff okay get off my page just go if you are bothered by someone looks why would you look at them for 15 whole damn minutes that's because you're not bothered that's because you're trolling okay that's what the answer to that is so 
that's the answer I need you guys to get below and tell me what you think about everything we just discussed and I'm coming with my video too see you later bye